Hello my dears, in our previous class we were discussing about an interesting topic that is light shadows and reflections. Now in today's session we shall discuss about how we can prepare a camera for ourselves. Are you excited to prepare it? Yes, it is nothing but a pinhole camera. Let us start with the principle. The principle of pinhole camera is based on rectilinear propagation of light. Do you have confusion that what is rectilinear propagation of light? It means light travels in a straight line. Rectilinear propagation means it travels in a straight line. Let us learn the working and construction of pinhole camera. The image formed by a pinhole camera is inverted and smaller in size when compared to that of original object. Yes, my dears, the image formed by the pinhole camera is inverted and smaller in size when compared to original object. And pinhole cameras are cheap and you can construct for yourself. Have you observed, have you visited Humpy and there you are uh, observing inverted image is it? That is nothing but a pinhole camera. Now take two rectangular boxes that fit into one another without leaving any gap. These are the two important uh, boxes you have to take. Next, make a small hole in the larger box at the center. Observe the video, like this you have to make the hole at the center. On the opposite side of the small box, opposite side of the small box, cut from the middle of a square of about 5 to 6 cm. Okay, 5 to 6 cm square you have to cut out the pot. Next, cover this opening with tracing paper. You know that already tracing paper is it? You are using that to draw something which, you, which is very tough to draw, is it? Then now finally slide the smaller box into the larger box ensuring that the pinhole and the tracing paper are in line with one another means they, ha they have to be in a straight line the pinhole of the first larger box and square of the second box should be in a straight line. Keep the lighted candle at a distance of 50 cm from pinhole camera. Means you have to keep the lighted candle at somewhat 50 cm distance. Okay. Now look at the candle through the hole of pinhole camera. Means you just look at the uh, candle through the pinhole camera. Then you can see the blur and inverted image of the candle on the screen of a camera. You can see the inverted and blur image. If you want to get a, a clear image, just slide the smaller box to adjust the focus so that you can capture the clear image of a candle you have to slide only the inner box means smaller box don't slide the outer box okay now let us see what are the observations of the image formed in the pinhole camera what are the observations you have observed now in this video we we are observing the image of candle formed is diminished in size is it what is diminished? Diminished means shortened. Okay. The size of the candle is shortened. Next image of the candle formed is inverted. Inverted means upside down. Inverted. Next image of the candle formed has color. Is it? Image of the candle formed is having color. This is all about how we can form a pinhole camera for ourselves just by using box and a candle and a dressing paper. Now, how it's happening? Why the inverted image is formed? Just see now. Observe the video. A light ray from the top of a candle falls on the tracing paper at A dash. Is it A and A dash are there? After passing through a pinhole, O means after passing through a pinhole, it falls invertedly. Okay, it is a straight line because light travels in a straight line. Already you know that that is rectilinear uh, propagation. 
here also in the same way a ray from the bottom of candle b falls at b dash similarly rays from the candle fall on the tracing paper after passing through the pinhole camera together these points of light make up an image of a candle you are observing in a video you can see an inverted image that is b dash and a dash of a candle so the image has got inverted is my dears by using this pinhole camera you can observe the eclipse okay you can observe the eclipse and you can observe the image of a sun and gradually becoming darker as the eclipse starts but never look at the sun directly just because it is very harmful for our eyes as the brightness of the sun is too much on the eclipse you might have seen those eclipse is it um, before uh, last year we are seeing this amazing picture uh, just it has become a total solar eclipse is it means uh, ring like structure has happened just like uh, we are observing in this video that is how actually the solar eclipse happens so we should not see these solar eclipse directly through our naked eyes we should use uh, something uh, just like a pinhole camera or the glasses which meant uh, for seeing those eclipses okay yes my dears this is all about a sliding pinhole camera which you can do for yourself at your home easily just by using two box and tracing paper now have there is an interesting pinhole camera in the nature do you know that sometimes when you pass under a tree covered with large number of leaves we notice small patches of sunlight under it is it these circular images are in fact a pinhole images you might have observed all these things in summer days when you are walking in the afternoon is it these act as a pinhole camera these gaps are all kinds of irregular shapes there is so many shapes you can observe in the shadow but we can see circular images of sun also is it but we can see circular images of sun you can observe these things if you are walking in the afternoon especially in the summer time you will observe this beautiful phenomenon of nature for yourself you can enjoy it just by putting your hands or by observing the circular rings which are formed on a ground just because of a natural pinhole camera formed by the sun and the tree is it and uh, you can also uh, check that these are possible just because the sunlight is passing in between the gaps of a leaf leaf of leaves of a tree is it thick leaves or there but there is small amount of gap if there is small amount of gap then the sunlight will pass through those gaps and they will form the images on a ground which we are observing in this video is it i have uploaded the image here you just see we can observe these kind of images just because of a natural pinhole camera or formed by sun and tree yes my dears and by this we conclude that light travels in a straight line it does not travels in a bent form how we can say this if you uh, light in a candle and if you want to see that through a pipe you can see that if the pipe is very straight to it then only you can see the lamp is it then only you can see the candle which you have lighted but if the, there is uh, if there is a slight bent in that you cannot see it so we can conclude that light pass in a straight line so we can say that propagation of light is rectilinear means rectilinear propagation of light will be happening in one nature means the, the um, propagation of light is in straight line okay my dears i hope all of you have understood this well how to uh, uh, make a pinhole camera at home and also uh, uh, which is the natural pinhole camera smidias thank you